Okay, all right, here we go. La Mulana extreme difficulty, your notes are upside down. Last time on La Mulana, we found Inferno Cavern and I had some very funny deaths and we solved some puzzles and I got flares, which I haven't used yet. I made it to the save tablet in here we learned about this statue with the body of a snake. And the lava is very dangerous. Um, I want to go to... Oh yeah, and I moved some of this. And I said I was going to show you my obsidian notes. I want to go to the room where I can get into... What is it? The labyrinth? Which is up here. Um... Yeah. It's gonna take me a minute to kind of remember everything we did. Let's I can show you my I can show you obsidian notes to try to to try to explain everything I did. Where why this one. Okay. So I put Ages of the sun and children all in one note because I kept linking back to things about children 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 um, And I made it its own tab it was under twin labyrinth, but I made it its own little section for inferno cavern Pretty much everything we did is in here. It is the source of strength We found a clue that says a cloak a cloak made of ice protects from heat. Welcome in. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. I need to move this over a tiny bit. There we go. We found the shop. Challenge the Inferno Cavern. That's an older note. Turn left and swing weapon. Turn right and swing weapon. The soul of the children. More children. I should link to this. There is more to this land than meets the eye. It is a pivotal location. Tread a different path and return. I haven't done that yet either. And I drew a map that was on that tablet. Hi, hi, Aryan. Welcome in. How are you? It's good to see you. We solved the Serdab of Light, and that gave us the flare. There's another weapon that lies beyond Pazuzu's guard. Stick to the walls once the flames die down, kick off the walls. I think this was the clue for the Serdab of Light entrance, but I'm not sure. We learned about the snake statues. At the bottom of this land lies the darkness that leads to death. And we learned about Ayanta Caves. And I think it has its own separate entry, yeah. Centerpiece is a statue of a goddess with a snake's body. Those are the main things. And we fought Viewer, which to me looked like a lion, so it just says lion. <laughs> I'm good. Picking up my driver's license tomorrow morning and starting a new job Wednesday. Congrats! That's very exciting. I hope it's like picking up the driver's license is very painless and not like a full-blown trip to the DMV. Coming into the game and listening to you talk is a wild time. It's, um... It's a lot. <laughs> I could talk about it for hours and it probably wouldn't make any sense. He does look like that. You're not lying. Thank you, Aspirator. I appreciate it. Okay, we've already dipped our toes in lava. And I've been up that staircase. That was how we got to the shop. Oh, I learned how to break these boulders. I'm not gonna survive the knife, the knockback. Oh, and then you fall like all the way down. No, we're just gonna die. It's fine. <laughs> the joke was not that bad. No need to immediately jump into the lava. Trust me, it wasn't the joke. We learned about. Yeah, there's like hidden software somewhere. Let me read this tablet and let me mark this room. 
Treasury of Ice, part two. With a chest. Colored pencils are ready. It's an excellent emote, yeah. And there's a switch. Whenever there's a chest, there's like always a switch and a tablet. One is a clue on either the chest itself or something else in that area. And sometimes the switch is linked to, linked to the chest and sometimes it's not. This looks like a block puzzle almost. Eden. We've seen Eden a, a couple times before. Okay, this is day eight notes, starting here. Those seeking Eden... Open the four boxes. Seek the four pedestals. Find the source of a phenomenal trap. In a place bathed in moonlight. Oh my god, that connects to so many things. That links to Eden and a place bathed in moonlight, which is the three women waiting in a secret location. And I forget where that clue is, but I can look for it in my other notes. In German, we don't say DMV, we say... <laughs> I can't. I can't. Landesamt für Burger und Ordnungsangelegenheiten. <laughs> no way. That's where I stop. That's where I stop. Okay, I just want to search for place bathed in moonlight. Oh, it's also Eden. Open four boxes, stand on four pedestals, stand before the face of the highest rank in a place bathed in moonlight. Very similar. But then what's the one with the ladies? <laughs> moonlit, not moonlight. Moonlit. No, I swear there was another one. I was... Oh, no, that's a promise location. I was told to choose three women there waiting at a promise location. Moon gazing pit. Also the moon. Okay, I wasn't that far off. Lots of moon things. Uh, if I close out of this, there's going to be fire right away. Run away. This looks like a, bo a box puzzle spot. Do you think I can have enough health to jump down and press this? No. Oh, it is a box puzzle. I have three health. I don't think that was worth it. <laughs> Whoops. Do you think if I save... Don't answer this. <laughs> but I wonder if I save, it'll stay, if it's one of the switches that'll stay pressed. I, it really doesn't matter if I go save right now or not. I didn't do anything except for reading the one tablet, but gosh, the principle. It's the principle of the matter. 
I know, dipping your toes in lava is bad and I was really uncoordinated with pressing that switch. The lava is lethal. Hey kids, if you're watching this channel, lava is lethal. I feel like, I feel like Grace Bruxner in Frog Detective coming on screen for a, for a PSA. German has long titles and words for the simplest things, yeah. As kids we used to play who can make the longest words. <laughs> Just combining things for the fun of it. We're starting out strong. Quicksand is okay and not as prevalent as children's TV makes it out to be. This is true. We talked about this when I played um, Monkey Island. Because it is yet another 90s example of quicksand. Okay, it didn't stay pressed. But we have more health now. Ah, 102. Much better. Nice. The ice cape! I will say that was quite worth it. With this frosty cloak, we're wearing it. We look cool. Fashion from ice, even a dip in the lava will deal only minimal damage. Okay. A nice cape! A nice cape. <laughs> I live near some really notorious quicksand that did kill a bunch of people though. Oh no. Okay, I'm gonna stick to it being lethal then. Hi, little Link, welcome in. How's it going? Cool, literally cool. It's made of ice. Treasury of ice. Well, heck. Now the world's our oyster. Why is there a platform Oh, there's another platform lower down in case you fall all the way to the bottom, probably. Dipping your toes in lava is now pretty okay. You still get hurt by boulders, though. I wonder if there's a breakable wall in this room where the hidden software is. <laughs> I wonder. Oh my god. No, no, no. But it only hurts us a little bit. I got too excited. Oh my god, I'm the worst swimmer. Okay, I'm gonna have to death warp here. Thank you! Freaking knockback. <gasps> and I got the refill! Worth it. How many hits does this take? Additional text memory. Do I need to write this down? No. Do ice capes stack? If you find two or three, does lava become a warm puddle? I wish. Hi, Lola. Welcome in. Never melt ice. Something like that. Put ice cream onto your clothes. It's the same. Did get far enough. He did not get far after hiding it. No. No, not at all. Bun plus? An upgrade for the text track software doubles your text storage. Sure. What text storage? Don't answer that. <laughs> but I don't know what that means yet. Does my memory free 680, free 630? I don't know. We can now chat twice as much. Enjoy. 
Okay. This is, uh, this is good. This is all very good. What was in this shop? Oh, another software for 150 coins. And then some spears that I wasn't able to purchase. It added more pages to my notebook, yeah. That must be it. No, right into the fire. I do wonder with some of these, like, if it's worth... Oh my god. Swimming is in this game is the worst experience possible. And I forget what I was saying. Oops. Oh, wow. No. I don't think there's a good way for me to get back to that room. Oh, I forgot to do the jump control thing, too. When do we get, like, flippers and crap to make us swim better? I mean, I know we're swimming in lava. Like, I shouldn't complain. But I'm complaining. Uh, forget this. It's pretty darn gross. It's way worse than the jumping. It's not even the- I mean, it is the knockback, but it's like the fact that you spend all this time picking a time to go and then there's like a flame that appears that you weren't expecting. And then you've wasted half your health on one screen. I think that's- that's- once you're really into the game and you're like, ah, I don't care about the combat, I'm just writing down all my notes and lore. Then you feel bullied by, especially bullied by the the weird controls and stuff. Okay, it told us to tread another path, so we're treading another path, and now we can swim, sort of, badly. Hi, llama. Welcome in. Sleepy at a normal time. Congrats. Well done. But yeah, the knockback is also terrible. It doesn't help. Knockback, jumping, and swimming are all awful in this game. I wonder what would happen if those, like, sank all the way down. And I really want to know if the skeletons down there have secrets. But I really don't want to swim through all that, also. And I'm gonna run out of shurikens. <sighs> okay, let's be brave and go back up here. They have skeletons in their closet, yeah. Oops, I need to remember how to do these jumps? No! <sighs> Leave me alone. No, 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 no. All right, let's do this. This is new. There's a bird enemy that I've never seen before. I don't really know how to draw this area. We have so many maps. This is like a fake pretend drawing of the other part of this. But let's draw it from the entrance to Inferno.
Behold. The twin labyrinth. L ra labyrinths, plural. I stayed up after not falling asleep after five hours in bed this morning, which wasn't fun, but I managed to have a very productive day. Have a good sleep, Llama. Get that rest. You deserve it. I have an even better word. I'm not going to try that, but thanks, Kitty. Oh my goodness. If I think about it too much, I get all soul searchy and, and weird. weird. Thank you, Llama. Welcome back to the human race. Enjoy your Earth Badger emotes, your ad free viewing. We're so glad to have you. It wouldn't be the same without you. Thanks for 29 months. I need emotional emotes. All the human emotions. Enjoy. Okay, here's the entrance to Inferno. There's a million... And by a million, I mean, I mean two switches in this room. There's some very scary-looking fire barriers. <laughs> and a tablet that I would like to read. Oh, we're singing. The Demon Lord of Hell, Beezlebub. He who guards the eight souls in front of the mother. The eight souls? The guardians? The eight different areas? I don't know. Uh, I forget how to spell labyrinth already. Yeah, this area is scary. Exactly, Llama. He who guards the eight souls in front of the mother. The mother! Who's trying to return to heaven. Something like that. We'll have to watch the movie to figure out how to spell it. Oh, this is a doorway? And there's a statue with a symbol on its back that I've seen before. That's like one of the wall seals. It's like a half snake statue, half serpent or something, and then I don't know like where to mark things with arrows, but here is the symbol that I see. Looks like this kind of. Creators hideout, welcome in, how's it going? I'm gonna do a quick search in my other notes to see. I drew it as one of the ones on the sigil tablet, I think. I don't think it looks like an entrance to any of the areas, but I could be wrong. Oh no, it looks like Temple of the Sun. It's exactly like the one that I have for Temple of the Sun. Weird. Oh! <laughs> Statue of the Giant in Land of Inferno. Words of spirit hidden within. Wait for them to show. It's right next to the symbol I drew. And it looks like a statue of a giant. Go figure. Thank you, past gen. I wouldn't know any of this if I hadn't written this down. I would have been like, huh, oh, that's weird. Oh, please don't get knocked back by this little guy. No! I don't trust that the labyrinth will take me back to the same spot. Edigna? It's 
Statue of... I don't know how to say that. A statue of twins. Said to be the last surviving descendants of the first child. I ran out of room again. On their back is an etching of the number three. Oh, we were just talking about decoding letters and numbers. And now I'm gonna have to do it. I don't know. Etching of number three, which looks like this thing that I just drew. Not very good at drawing this one. But I'll do my best. Tea time. Enjoy your yes. tea, kitty. I hope it's yes. good. Yes. Thank you for the yes. follow. I appreciate it. Welcome in. Wait for it to appear. What does this say? It says... Soul survivors of the first child. The third child raptured them and gained the first child's knowledge. Words of spirit hidden within. Wait for them to show. Thank you for the hydrate. Cheers! Let's wait. See if anything happens if we just wait. There's another tablet down there. There's some more of those like fire slug enemies. There's this one, there's this like flickering drawing on the wall. This one's blank. Nope. These tubes I don't know what to do with. Been watching Castlevania Symphony, Symphony of the Night. Thank you, I appreciate it. Glad to, glad you made it over from uh, from the YouTube. Or if you may, if you were watching them on Twitch. Also cool. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. This is day eight of La Mulana. We've been working hard at it. A different fascinating visual theme. Yeah. The labyrinths are kind of weird. I don't know. I waited. I don't know if I'm if I was like idle long enough. If that plays any part for like controller input has anything to do with it. Not so far that we've seen. It's fascinating though. It's got kind of like an armband. Did I? I wonder if all of these dolphins have a way to walk past them and I never tried. That would be just like me. This has a tablet and some switches. Oh. The knockback! Oh no, I can't get out of here at all? Well, shoot.
Oh, if I don't jump, I can walk down there. But I think I'm dead if I fall again. That was unsatisfying. I want to go heal again. We're sleeping in the laser now. That was rude. Death pit! I love midair sleeping. One of my favorite animations in this game is midair sleeping and midair snacking. <laughs> oh yeah, I was saying earlier when we were just chatting that I wanted to map a certain area. It's the surface. I really need to make a map of the surface. No, I don't want to go in from Inferno Cavern. I want to go in from Temple of the Sun. Just came up with it. Now I need to know. Oh, uh, is it a Steven Universe reference? That would be a pretty deep Steven Universe reference. Like, it's not a super recurring name, but it's definitely in there. What? Accidental secret block? in the world? I've gotten so lucky on a couple of these. Of animations. I like how Lameza slams into the ground when falling too high. I do too. When I found out it didn't do fall damage, I thought it was really cute. But most of the time when I started this game, I thought that meant that we died. Like from the trailer. Not lucky. Inspired whipping. Alright, I'll take it. Oh yeah, this is the map where I messed up the color coding really bad. A secret room! Isis? Isis, it's you? Excitement! Oh my god, are we gonna get a fairy? Are we gonna get a fairy? She sits higher than any of the other gods. Let's find out what's in the chest. If I can open the chest. Because who knows. She's cool even with the tiny Terraria wooden chair on her head. Yeah. <laughs> Was wondering if you'd find that one. Wait, as rude as the game is. Uh... Surprising that it doesn't die from fall damage. I know, I'm so glad. Well, a statue, okay, yes. <laughs> Steven's father is referred to as Star Child from. T oh, yeah, Marty calls him Star Child. I was like, does Greg call Steven Star Child? That doesn't ring a bell. It's Marty. Is there gonna be a boss? There's gonna be a riddle. Isis, the mother of Horus, a flood of motherly love shall grant thee healing powers. Healing powers. Okay. Okay, alright. We haven't really experienced a lot of motherly love in this game so far, I would say. A statue that resembles the ancient Egyptian deity Isis. Not much any not much other information. Okay, let's push it. Pendant! That was easy. A pendant featuring a decoration of the goddess Isis. This is too straightforward. I don't trust it. 
Okay, let's go get a fairy. Do I have a labyrinth save pendant? I can never remember. Not a labyrinth, a corridor. Love me some Greg songs, yeah. Wait, I should save first. Oh no, it's too late. <laughs> that is indeed Isis's pendant. My fellow fairies will help you now as promised. We shall make it so that tiny lights, wait, hang on. Pendant, fairies will help as promised. Tiny lights are visible in specified areas. Is this like a hint system? Um, you can answer that. The game got a list a little bit less unfairy. Selling cosmetic DLC, yeah. They got festive. Come into contact with lights and the fairies will appear. Oh, okay. Okay, then I don't give any more details than that. Please. Thank you. As I am the queen, I shall remain here. Return to me if you are faced with a task beyond my fairy's powers. Task beyond fairy power. Got it. We got another stretch break. That went by, that hour went by fast. Okay, I, it's not like I'm gonna be able to see it right away, but let's save and um, take a quick break. We're at the 12 hour mark. Do you want me to turn up? I, I'm gonna turn up the music. I wanna turn up the corridor music for our break. Time flies when you're making progress. A lot of it was me swimming in lava, but okay. <laughs> All right, enjoy. I need to use the bathroom really quick. Um, and I don't know, maybe just, maybe just a small snack. Maybe like a three minute break instead of a 90 second. Okay. Thanks everyone. What if I got brave and bumped the volume down? only to two instead of one. Getting wild, I don't know. What do you think? Can you all handle it? Except when we go in Sun Temple. <laughs> okay, my chair doesn't want to cooperate. You'll regret it in the Sun Temple, yeah. Maybe just, just another minute of this. I shouldn't jinx- I shouldn't ruin a good thing, I shouldn't jinx it. I need to focus. Oh, but now it's so quiet. We'll try it. It's quiet, we'll try it. So now that we did that... Um... What I was doing was actually going to Sun Temple. So that I could go in the other entrance of... The Labyrinth again. And then I got distracted by fairies. I wonder if the fairies help me in Sacred Lake. What if we just get rid of all of my current ideas and go see if there's a fairy in Sacred Lake because, and I say this because, there's a tablet in the Sacred Lake room that talks about fairies. You remember? You already know. I'm the one who's not with it. Who's not in the know. Hi, Doomsday. Kind of silly, but I had a job interview today and one of the people on the panel had glasses like yours. Oh, yay. I'm glad that it gave you good vibes. Welcome in. I hope everything goes well. 
with the interview process. I have no idea what you're talking about. Alright, fair. Some of you, the ones that get it, get it. <laughs> the ones that don't, don't. <laughs> La Mulana edition. Hi Kazuka, welcome in. How are you? We are thriving in the ruins today. This room, is there a special light? There's an opening in that wall. But I don't see any special lights, which is a disappointment, because this tablet talks about fairies. The fairy will gently heal thou, the fairy will help thy fight, the fairy will provide treasure, the fairy will reveal secrets. Yeah, explor exploration is really good today. Um, that's a fairy light. We got the fairy... The Isis Pendant. And this is our first fairy. Hi! Now, do you help me fight that other boss that I already fought? Do you follow me from room to room? How long do you stay with me? I love her! Help me open this chest. No. Okay, well, this is nice. At least we have a friend. You barely met her and already bombarding her with questions. <laughs> I already forgot some of what fairies do. I remember healing. Yeah. She's gone! Okay, so maybe it's on like a timer. Well, that was fun. <laughs> that was wholesome. Um, does she reappear right away? She gone forever? Don't answer that, but maybe... Maybe it, mm, um... Maybe you have to, like, leave and come back. I find it hard to believe that she's gone forever, forever. She might be on a break, you know. Fairy union? <laughs> Link, listen! She's so cute, I love her. I have hidden treasure edition of these games. I have yet to play it. The fact you have a notepad for games scares me into playing this. Oh, but it's so fun. Hi, Lone Toffee. Welcome in. You don't have to play with a notebook. I'm enjoying the experience with the notebook. I will say that these games probably aren't for everyone. <laughs> it would be fun. Okay, she's still not back. We'll come back later. It would be fun to try it without a notebook as a memory game. Um, cause there's a lot of like repetition that I don't need to write down every single line of text that I do. Would not enjoy it, yeah. The games are a bit hardcore, but it's a blast, yeah. I, I, I would agree. They're hardcore in like not a combat way at all. Okay, we're going here now. I'll be brave with the music in this area. Does the fairy help me ride the roller coaster? Welcome to the next hour of the stream. Does the fairy this? Does the fairy this? Don't answer any of them, please. <laughs> the fairy lore. I'll do the jigsaw that came with it. Okay. 
That's good too. This is where we get the pendant. Oh. Um. I bet the jigsaw's lovely, yeah. It sounds like it would be really fun. This, this song reminds me of one of the tracks in Axiom Verge. I feel like it changed slightly. Maybe not. It's probably because it's just louder. Jogsaw. <laughs> A jigsaw with legs. Yeah. Oh. 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 Oh my god. I'm running away from this orange thing. Uh, not successful. I wanted to go up here again. I don't like this room. I don't know if there's a room that I like. You know the room that I like. The warm puddle. It's not even a room. I have a literal and imaginative sense of humor, especially if it results in silly images. I hoped it would be a jigsaw map. Is it, um, like, game cover art? The, the reason I love this game so much is that it scratches the same itch that, like, Outer Wild scratched for piecing things together a little bit at a time. Oh, I actually feel like I want to go the other way. And it's very open world, which I'm always a fan of. Or not open world, non-linear. I'm a fan of non-linear games. Let's go up here this time. Jigsaw of the whole game's layout in the pixel art would be so sweet. Is there a map? Like a artistic version of the map? in poster form. I would buy it. I'm gonna take my hand-drawn map and smush it all together and take it to a printer. I would also buy that, yeah. When you're done, you should at least check out the wiki's collection screenshot maps, definitely. For those who don't know, you can't see it. I'd have to move the camera around. I have um, a very large size Hollow Knight map in a poster form. It's like the painted canvas version of poster on the wall behind me in the office. And I love that thing so much. The artsy one. Like, I have a paper version that came folded up with a special edition of the Switch copy of the game. Um... But this one is bigger. <laughs> it's a bigger map. Oh yeah, I don't have the map for this area yet. You have to collect them... ...as you go. This has a suspicious looking block. And a tablet, a broken tablet. And an entrance to the next area, to the right. These enemies are brutal! They're so fast! Okay, this doesn't say anything. There's an eye on the ceiling, so I don't really want to try to break this block. Oh, but it's breakable. It's money! Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Oh no, I still have 20 left. I finally got money! <gasps> we gotta go save. Immediately. I found a higher than an in-game resolution version of the map visible right when I start the game. Finally, I found La Mulana, the adventure starts here, cutscene. Wait, which one would I buy if they made it? 
I don't know, like an artsy version of a drawn up the ruins of La Mulana. Or are you asking which one I have? I was talking about Hollow Knight. Hand drawn maps are bringing me back to days. Uh, my friend and I created role playing games. Nice. Discovered some button I never noticed. Makes typing easier. Nice. I'm glad we got money. We need to save up for either ammo or software. The two essentials in La Mulana. Anything else in this room I want to look at? No. There's a god that controls death. There's a god that absorbs life. The words that seal these powers were entrusted to an innocent girl. Okay. Is a god that you're seeing like my eraser that this whole time absorbs life. The words that seal these powers were entrusted to an innocent girl. Do we think Mulbrook maybe is the only girl that we've met or we've learned about the three women or maybe the innocent maidens that are associated with chi -Yo? I'm not sure. Don't answer that. I might turn the music back down. <laughs> Yeah, thanks for answering that. Hi, Jiggly. I love La Mulana's 2 map more than this one, but this one's good. Okay, I was just standing there getting beat up and I don't have very much health. I should go save because of the money. Oh, but I want to explore. These enemies are so hard to get past. No! No, I'm stuck. I chickened out. <sighs> Coward. How do we... Whoa. The knockback carried over. How do we go down from... 128 to 13 so fast? Lava. <sighs> we got punched all the way back up to the surface. At least this way, I feel like I'm making sort of progress. Oh no. In the labyrinth. I keep pressing the wrong button for Holy Grail. It gets out of hand in an instant. It really does. Especially if you're like really determined on one specific thing. Okay, don't hate me, but it needs to come back down. I feel like I'm yelling. Especially with Temple of the Sun. It is what it is. Oops. I think it's just Temple of the Sun that I can't handle now at... The oh, I forgot at the louder volume. I wonder... Mm, I'm not gonna go check that skeleton right now. Except... 
One of these times I have to make a point of going on a mission to check the skeletons that are under lava. And just go when I'm at full health to check it out and see if anything happens. No, go. Okay. You are mean. I know what brought me down in health. This room. Wait, there's a fairy. Was there a fairy here before? But I have to use a weight to get it. What happens if I leave and come back? Is it still there? Yeah? Maybe once I have a more clear idea of what I'm doing here. We can do a checkbox on this suspicious block, because we got that. This lizard needs to move out of the way. Okay. Bye! Iframes. Using iframes to get around you. No, wait. Okay. Stay up there. I want to see if this is a door or just one of those, like, statue of the twins, gate of the twins. It's just a gate of the twins. And a dolphin. Why so many dolphins? Whoa, what is that? It's the Nebra Sky Disc! And a cool mural! And a box puzzle and a tablet. There's a million things in here and I'm gonna immediately get knocked back and fall down this pit. Why is it always dolphins? Yes, 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 yes. Okay, I can't read about this thing. Thank you for the follow, I appreciate it, welcome in. Those that created this contraption are fools. They mistakenly created a puzzle that could not be solved. But after all this time, it has been rewritten. Those who fail to solve this puzzle shall be punished. I should have brought the fairy. <laughs> Nebra Sky Disc uh, Miniature Room. Those that created this contraption are fools. Mistakenly made a puzzle. I, I gotta read it once and then I gotta write it. Helps it stick. Solved. After all this time, it's rewritten. The rest is still unwritten. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Those who fail to solve punished in all caps. Two blocks. I want to read the mural. Oh, I'm stuck down here. Oh no, I'm stuck. Can I? Can you give me knockback to get out of here? Oh no, because when you have knock knockback, you can't do control inputs. It's very funny. I really wanted to read the mural. 
There's an eye in here, but it didn't care that I tried to strike that block because it's not an ancient ruin. 43, my health is just ticking down and down and down. Let me out! Let me out! Rude. Oh, <gasps> I got out! I'm gonna jump right back in. <laughs> but now I know I can do it. Mural. It's probably not worth anything. Dolphin combat vehicle. What? I'm not gonna write that twice. Combat vehicle being pulled by dolphins. Ooh, such a badass and unexpected sentence. Why is this in the inferno? Inferno dolphins are all the rage. How did I manage that jump? Oh, like that. I don't think I can get out of here. There's three blocks. I'm scared that we're gonna immediately die from this puzzle, but... Um... Technically, I don't think I did anything except for read a tablet. Like, I don't think I picked up any items. I think there's only... each block can only go to one place. But now I'm trapped! Oh, I think I needed to use it to get out of here. But I couldn't get to the right side of it. Because there's not enough room to jump over it. Weird. It's a pixel perfect thingy. My original question has been answered! <laughs> They thought they could get away with something called Dolphin Combat Vehicle. It's pretty cool looking though. Okay, well, we're soft locked. No, we're not. We're just gonna warp out. What a strange room. I'm supposed to go in your terminal, no worries, no worries. Um, I've been in the room below this. It has a switch for one of those, like, laser doors. Okay, let's do what I said I was gonna do. I, I hate having, like, 36 health just doesn't feel like enough to go into the labyrinth. So even though I have enough health that I could go do some other things, that's not what I want to do right now. So I gotta run up here and heal again, just to dive back in. I think now is gonna be the mission I said I was gonna go on, though, and... Um, dive in the lava to try to, to see if the skeletons have anything to say. <laughs> that sounds so silly. Let's go hang out with some skeletons. Money! You almost messed that up. I'm getting better at this. Used to be really hard to walk down here. I mean, it still is, but I used to fall a lot more than I am now. Okay, ready? Let's go hang out with some skulls. Yay! 
Owie, hot, 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 hot. B -b -b burning. Damn it, this place is hot. Even if I wrote a will and burn to ash. Amazing. Worth it. This one doesn't say anything. I'm sinking! I'm gonna sink into lava and be engulfed in flames. Damn it, I'll be back, but not really. I'm terminated. I think that's it. I don't think I can get out of here. Oh, yes, I can. I can swim. I don't have to walk along the bottom. What was I thinking? That was very silly. I think it's really interesting that those floating blocks look just like the ones in the block puzzles. Can we get these two? Let's get these after this orange thing. Oh, well, never mind. This one doesn't say anything. I'm stuck. This one doesn't have a skeleton. And this one doesn't say anything. Let me through. Let's fall through here. Oh. Well, that's unfortunate. There's really nothing down here? Boo. Ooh, I got lucky. Okay, then I didn't. <sighs> the ice cape is great, yeah. That saved us. For sure. When should I use my, um, my flare gun that I keep forgetting I have? Oh! Not here! Gate of Guidance! I finally have a freaking light! I want to go do that now. We've been waiting for a flashlight and I was so sidetracked with other things that I forgot we have one. Yeah, let's go do that. <laughs> Is there genuinely... Oh, I, I want to go back to the mural room in the labyrinth. Do we have enough health to get up there? Safely? I'm close-ish to a refill. Aww. Wait, I gotta go up this way. Kitty, is everything okay? Is stream okay? Oh, I forgot that was a live skeleton and not one that I could read. And not a skeleton book. Stream is fine? Okay. I figured you'd tell me. I don't- I- it's just the past couple of days some of the people I've been watching have really been having Twitch issues. But not as bad as like last week when it was logging people out of their accounts. That's never fun. I need to start remembering when I come into this room that I can walk up right away because it takes a minute for that first flame to light up. Oh, I don't think I'm going to make it. We're already down to 38.
Come on, refill. And then I have to wait for this lizard. Can I reset the room? Yes. Get out of here, lizard. I have two caltrops left. I should probably, um... Use them on lizards. I should probably buy more. Okay, we're back. <laughs> Immediately knock back. Can you move off that ledge, please? Oh, I jumped too early. Oh, thank you. Nope, 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 nope. How am I supposed to get to that top room? To get behind that block? I don't think I can do this yet. Okay, but it shows... Maybe I can do it if I make the Nebra Sky Disc match what this shows. The reason I came back was to make note of it, and then I started getting distracted. It shows the sun on top. And the star to the bottom left. And the moon to the bottom right. So if we make it look like this with the sun... Which is coincidentally also the number three, maybe, which I don't know if that matters, but we should make it like this and come back. Right now it's set to moon, I think, still. It's been that way for a while. Also, I forgot to check Discord. On break. Uh, okay, never mind. Sorry if we missed you. And thanks for the intro. I was gonna check on break. So. What do I want to do now? Gate of Guidance. Well, heal. And save. I wonder if... Okay, we got our heal. Shoot, I was really close. That's okay. Um... If we use this light, if it opens the chest, I wonder if there's a seal inside. What does this say again? Offer three lights to the heavens. And it has a... What? Which wall seal is that? I don't know. Okay, first time using a flare. One, two, three. Didn't work. Maybe offer it at the wall seal itself. I have 19 left. Nope. All right, wasting all my flares. To the heavens. Maybe to the Nebra Sky Disc. I don't know. To the stars. That was a failure. We haven't been back here in a minute.
Waiting for the elevator. Thank you. Um, I want to go all to the heavens. Shaft to the heavens. I want to try it here, too. Ugh. I'm gonna go down to the sky disc first. Because there's three rooms called Shaft to the Heavens. How do I know which one? And they're leading to the heavens. Is this the heavens? I have so many questions. Don't answer any of them. The welcoming punch of the giants, I know. They love to punch me. Okay, wait. I thought that was gonna make it go the other way. That's okay. That didn't work either! Just constantly setting off flares inside ancient ruins. It's perfect. Okay, but this is the setup I want for the labyrinth. I feel like I have slightly more direction today than the start of stream yesterday. But I still feel like, what if all of these threads end up not leading anywhere? <sighs> it's gonna be fine. Oh, this is gone forever now. Great. I liked when that platform was there. It was a good platform. I can jump over here right away. Oops. Enough time to get hit with a bone boomerang. The fairy's still here. Should we grab the fairy? Oh, I hate this room. Do you think the fairy helps me fight in this room? There's so many unknowns. Let's get rid of this enemy. And then go... She'll heal. That's right. You always want to hang out with her because she'll heal. Hello! Are you also pink? They're all pink! She looks like, um... I was gonna say a Powerpuff Girl, but not really. More like the Totally Spies haircut. I'll take knockback on that. Okay, we're here. Did I do the thing that I needed to do? Didn't change anything. Fairy, help me! Can I do this jump again? Yes. Hi, Steel Brigade. Welcome in. How's it going? Oh, she's gone already? What a shame. Maybe something will happen this time because I did the sky disc. No. I don't know, then. 
Maybe I was supposed to do this one first. <sighs> yeah, it feels like it felt like I had two theories and neither of them panned out to be anything. What a bummer. Um Oh, she did heal me. That's good. Let's go back to Inferno. We were told to come back to the Inferno and tread a different path. I don't know what that means yet. We can walk in the lava now, so that's cool. This looks like a dead end. Let me get my Inferno map. This one. On the very bottom of the pile. Oh, is the Hall of Worship where the save is? Yeah, I didn't- I never put that on that block, but that's what it is. Aww. I hate swimming. Okay, forget it. I'm going over here. We're treading a different path. Supposedly there's a room to the left of here. I don't think I can get to it from this way. Swimming is the literal worst. Swimming in lava, swimming in water, it doesn't matter. Oh my god. I give up. <laughs> Immediately gives up. What about- oh, there's a trapdoor here. No, no, no. What about this? Oh, come on. Cloak made from ice. We have the cloak. You drop some money. And there's a room below this? Doesn't look like it. I wonder if this... I wonder if there's a drawing That has to do with any of this. And which way, maybe these blocks have to go in a certain order and then it makes a staircase down below us. There's one drawing in particular I'm thinking of. This one. But I don't know, that doesn't look anything like this room. What if I turn it on its side? No.
Is that the drawing on the tablet in this room? Maybe that's why I'm thinking of it. Hi, Chai. Can't stay, but wanted to quickly come in and say hi. I'm full of joy having started tap dance. Yeah, I saw. Have fun. I'm glad you're having, uh, having a good time with it. Getting some joy. It's good to see you. All the joy. Wait, do I have a joy button? No, but I have this one. Okay, the reason why I was thinking of that drawing is because it's literally right here in this room. Whoops. But maybe this is a map of... the caverns themselves. Like, this is the room of worship. And this is over here. The statues up here. This is the entrance to the labyrinth. This is this like weird unconnected thing. And then it comes down and then it goes off into the Sardab of Light. I mean, this is a stretch. But we would be right here. You are here. Tread a different path and return to this land again. Hmm. Maybe... Have I ever entered the labyrinth and then come back out? I don't think I have. Also, we have not seen anything about Pazuzu. Beyond Pazuzu's guard. Who's Pazuzu? We don't know yet. No. This mine is gonna blow me up! And then it's gonna reappear. Worst thing. I'm just gonna run away. There was a cross. Do we think the crosses have anything to do with it? I don't think so. Oops. No! Getting better at this room. Hi, Daxon. How are you? Welcome in. Okay, we're in here. But then I'm gonna I'm gonna tread a different path and leave and come back. Doesn't look any different. Can I go to the left? It says there's a room over there. Relaxing after board game night. Awesome. What did you play? I think there's a secret door somewhere. Okay, that wasn't smart. Stick to the walls. Once the flames die down, kick off the walls and proceed. Stick to the walls. Okay, well you can't get hit. 
midair, otherwise you can't try hitting the walls. Does this room have an exit? No, there's no way. Hi Cavernous, welcome in. How are you? I played a game I got for myself for Christmas, which is Firefly Misbehaven. A game called Silencia, if I remember correctly. That sounds cool. It's always uh, good to get yourself a Christmas present. I approve. I'm gonna use one of my two caltrops. And then I might need a hint where to buy. Don't say it yet. But I might need a hint where to buy caltrops because I forget. Because as far as I know, there's no other way to break the ground below my feet. But I've done it before. I don't remember how. Oh, I have six now? Oh, because I picked them up. No, those are shuriken. I have three. It's not even where I wanted them to go. It didn't work. Hmm. <sighs> Needs to buy more. I'm heading out to catch some sleep. Have fun sneaking around. Have a good one, kitty. Have a good sleep. Thanks for hanging out. We'll see ya. I want to know what this means by tread a different path. And why I can't get to these other rooms. There's two underneath where I'm standing. And there's like a whole row of rooms to the left. That must be where I'm supposed to kick off the wall. Okay, so maybe it wasn't the Sir Daub of Light clue. That's fine. We were working on other stuff. I feel like it's right here. Yeah... At least this is where the map says there's like a whole other hallway. Stretch break! Hang on, I'm busy catching on fire. This part is really hard because of the timing of these and the knockback like once you get hit that's it you're done I'll try one more time and then we'll take our stretch break just a, just a 90 second Every time, like, I jump right after. It's the same timing. So maybe, it says stick to the wall, but maybe you can skip that first flame. Okay, one more time. Just one more time getting barbecued. La Mesa loves barbecue. Oh, that worked even worse. I hate this. Kick off the wall. Maybe I stick to the right hand side? I don't know. It's just like... You can see kind of like... Maybe the architecture behind there? It's hard to say what that is. Hi, Antable. Welcome in. 
How's it going? There's gotta be another way. I wish I could drop something. Like caltrops. I don't have enough though. That wouldn't do it. It takes, also, if I hit this one time, it's not gonna break open the wall. It takes so many times to break a wall block. I hate it. Maybe I need to use the gun to shoot open the wall so it'll take less hits. Kick off the wall. Kick it with my feet. I think if I go into that shop, all the enemies will respawn. Maybe I can't even do it yet. Maybe I have to get this wall seal first. This is annoying. How's everybody doing? Are we ready for a stretch break? Oh, well, now my health is dissipating. I could still do this, like, multiple more times before we reach zero, but... Maybe we'll go back and heal. It doesn't take- it's not too bad getting back here. I need some emotional warm puddle support. One of these days I'm gonna get karma from beating up all these snakes. Okay. Save. Quick break. See you in a little bit. Thanks everyone. I appreciate it. Happy Monday. How's it going? How was the rest of your Sunday and the start to your week? My blanket is all fold it over. There we go. Um, I don't really want to keep throwing myself down that hallway. More weekend per week would be great. I agree. I agree. We have this other note about turning left and right. Maybe we do that in the hallway. Hmm. I don't have to solve that right now, but I want to. Work was chill today. Oh, nice. I'm glad. It's good for a Monday. For sure. I'm just bopping. I might need a nudge. We'll see. I have, like, a lot to go on. We might go back and talk to Mulbrook. We might go try to use a fairy to fight the giant. We still have to figure out that statue with the etching of the number three.
There's just so much. Okay, maybe I'll try this weapon thing and then we'll go see Mulbrook. I don't know. I don't know. I'm floundering. All those options. Too many options. I can't decide. Overdroid can press Xbox and PlayStation buttons natively now. That's awesome. Used to require three software to do so. Oh my god. That's a lot of software. Wait, I said I was gonna... Oh yeah, this is where I have to go to try it. I was like, I said I was gonna go do the labyrinth, or the inferno, before talking to Mulbrook. I'm gonna catch fire! Okay. Still suspicious of that other platform above this. Do I have any other drawings about this room with the light and the platforms? Hmm. No. The truth shall be revealed. Cast a light, the truth shall be revealed. I don't know. I need to pay really close attention to room names because because Isis anterior chamber ended up being a clue of where to break that wall even though I didn't realize it. So I bet there's there is another anterior chamber, actually, and I noted that when we found Isis' anterior chamber. I can't remember... Hang on. I don't remember exactly what it was. But I can find it again. Maybe, maybe not. Treasury of Ice was, too, yeah. Yeah, um... Oh, no, that's the same one. Oh, Inferno has one. Inferno has a different one next to the Ice Treasury. Interesting. Maybe it was outside of the Ice Treasury that was talking. it was talking about. I don't know. Uh, but now I remember where it is. It's this one and then the Isis one. I- this is a bad idea. Why am I jumping down this pit again? Ha! <laughs> I hate it. I want to go talk to Mulbrook instead. This room sucks. Every time I have to push the dang block. <laughs> I'm convinced there's something to break in the wall there. But I can't get to it.
No, we're gonna get hit. Okay, I give up. Where does Mulbrook hang out again? Somewhere around here. Right here. Yeah. Hi, Dama. Thanks for the good luck. I appreciate it. Welcome in. Mulbrook finally starting to wake up. Mulbrook is the daughter of an excellent tailor and one of the race of the four philosophers. This is like Mulbrook part three. The tailor that made the ice cloak? Okay. Father worked for the philosophers, naturally Mulbrook served them as well. Making spelling errors in my notes already. Both served philosophers. Mulbrook was chosen to be your helper because of her excellence. Okay. If you run into problems, come see me. Mulbrook cannot move to preserve eternal life. Okay. corridor that never ends you say that's the endless corridor of course it would never end but if you had the key of eternity it would travel deep inside okay <laughs> even deep inside it's endless it's brilliant okay oh that's it have a nice nap. Oh, no, she's awake again. Fairy queen, the fairies too live inside the ruins to help you. They'll reveal, relieve your fatigue, but amongst them is a fairy that holds a key. The key of eternity? <laughs> Apparently it is a key that unlocks some trap. When you find it, take it to the puzzle you failed to solve. I bet that's the labyrinth one? Key unlocks trap. Cause the fairies can't go very far. But it didn't look like she was carrying anything. Okay, that's it. That's it for now. Meanwhile, the Sonics are sonicking. Sonicking up a storm. Well, I'm glad we went to visit Mulbrook. That was nice. This room hasn't changed a bit. Oh, I got a flare back. That's nice. This room also hasn't changed a bit. Weird crumbling statues. And my bad aim. No. What 
if I use a flare on them. Those go straight up. No. <sighs> What's this room all about? There's no light up ahead. I've never been into the mirror place before. Ooh, that gave me a refill. Another room with a scary eyeball. And what looks like a room that should have hidden blocks, but I'm too afraid to attack them. Hmm. Are we hitting a point? I can't say. I can't tell. I don't know. Too much information happened today. Oh, I'm glad I didn't break those on accident. I almost lost a bunch of money again. Invisible floor. I don't really want to go in this room. But I don't know where else to go. Sanctuary. Do you think anything's changed now that... I've seen Isis. Now that I know about the fairies. Oh, I can't jump off here. This room is the same. Oh, there's an elephant flea there that I didn't see. <sighs> okay, we're at three hours and 22 minutes. I need to decide what else I want to do today. I'm floundering. I feel like there's so much to go off of. But I just have no... We could do something with the statue of the the three with that giant. But where did I write about that? In the land of the inferno, words of spirit hidden within wait for them to show. Trying devoted to courageous men. This is all about the sun temple. There's a man, therefore there's a woman. Weapon shall not be used within the woman. Solve all puzzles, make descent. Polished by maiden of purity. Call forth the power of the twins. Isis gave birth to Horus, figure of motherhood. Because of this, weighed silently perched higher than any other god, we found her. I was told to choose three women. They are waiting at the promised location. I couldn't do it. They still wait in moon-gazing pit. Pierce her heart in my stead. She who never lets her smile fade. We've never found the moon-gazing pit either. 
I don't know what that means, unless it's just another name for the Nebra Sky Disc. Is that the ghosts down there? Celestial bodies lie within. Control them, even time may be shifted. Jump on floating platform. Hmm. This is Mausoleum of the Giant Stuff. Two weapons are kept- this is Inferno now. Kept in this land, one lies beyond Pazuzu's guard. Who is Pazuzu? Don't answer that. Um, <laughs> stick to the walls. I read all this at the beginning of stream and it doesn't make any more sense. But I would like to know who Pazuzu is. Someday. Beyond Pazuzu's guard. Pahuhu. If I search my notes for Pazuzu, I don't think I will find anything, but let's try. Just the note about the weapons. I feel like every stream of this game <laughs> comes to this point where there's like a million things I want to do at the start. And we do stuff and it's like a bunch, pow, pow, pow. And then I have no idea what to do afterwards. <laughs> Should probably go buy some more weights. Soon. Oops. Going back to Inferno, I guess. Let's go look for Pazuzu. And try to solve getting to the rest of the map here. Oops. Are you Pazuzu? You don't really seem to be guarding, you just seem to be standing. Is this that weird cross on that other map? Maybe. Maybe the maybe the crosses are a reference point. I'm still suspicious of that map too. And there's another part of the map up into the left. I wonder if you get to it from the labyrinth or something. Swing left, and then swing right. Swing left, and then swing right. Come on, ancestors, help me. Oh, I made it that time, but it still didn't help. Left, right, left, right. Left, right. I'm just gonna be doing that in every room. Does the fire- you can answer this. Does the fire make you walk faster? <laughs> just a little bit? Just the tiniest bit? 
Sometimes I feel like I get a speed boost from being on fire. It's kind of funny. Not that I know of. Just mental. Seems like you are, but you're not. Oh no, the snake is enraged. As if there weren't enough fireballs. Do you unenrage when I walk up here? It's possible. <sighs> fireballs from the snake, meatballs from the lava. Are you Pazuzu? No, you're... A statue of a goddess with a snake body. And that other one, there's a god and a goddess snake, which I think are the twins. Maybe one of them is Pazuzu. Pazuzu makes me think of Futurama. Is that the name of the bird in... In Futurama, the Professor Farnsworth is trying to find that one time. It's been a while. It looks like this goes up from here on that one mini map thing that I drew. Pazuzu. So does that mean it's a bird? Maybe it's not a snake then. Maybe it's a bird. Fascinating. If I whip the walls enough times. Something will happen. Oh, I will get knocked back from a skeleton. And forget how to swim. No, you evil... You evil minion. Okay, we're going this way. Oh yeah, this is much easier to get out of the lava. Stick to the walls. When the fire dies down, kick off the walls. It's not that wall. Oops. Good times the skeletons were slow and lazy before they hurled their bones at you. I know. They've gotten exceedingly vicious. And they take a million more hits. Okay, they take two more hits. And these meatballs break up into pieces. No! Oh my god, that was so close. If that one cross thing is supposed to be a clue on that map, I don't know where the other one is. It should be in this room, but it's not. Maybe, or maybe in the other. God, I don't know. I guess I'm really, like, pulled to finding new parts of the map because I'm running away from my problems and I don't want to deal with any of the riddles I already have which is like a thousand riddles but I'm like no those aren't good enough I need to go to some other area La Mulana reinforcing Running away from your problems. Ow. 
And now we're back here. I hate this room. No, I thought the other one was gonna go. This is far worse than the block puzzle room. The block puzzle room was fun. <laughs> I need some... Like... You know. I'm not calling lurkers out a lurk. But I need some emotional support emote spam if you have it in you. <laughs> I'm feeling defeated. Or just a dance party because the music's... A bop. Did I get anything that time? I don't think so. <laughs> Thanks. Riddled with riddles, exactly. <laughs> Thanks, Petrie. Thanks, fishies. I, this doesn't feel like a solution. This feels like a non-solution, but I really want there to be something in the wall here. Indy, what's up? <laughs> It goes one, two, two. One, two, two. But then I fall right on my butt on that one down there. Still. Thanks for redeeming Bean Garden. Everyone hydrate. Water all those human beans. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. My stream deck is like really acting up lately. It keeps double pressing. Hello. I just wanted the hydrate button. Reminds me to take my medicine. Yeah, there you go. Blame technology. Yep. Always. <laughs> Stream starting soon. That's the second time in one stream that I've double pressed though. I mean, that the stream deck acted up. I swear I keep jumping at a different time and it doesn't matter. <laughs> Cut this part out of the VOD. I solved this immediately. Okay, good. We love the fire hitbox. It just, it's one of those things that feels like you should be able to do something and that you're just doing it wrong every time. Enough that you're convinced that like, no, no, I'm just, I'm just messing it up. I have horrible luck. I'm horrible button pressing. Like, it's gotta be something. Enough that you try it like this many times before you say, I guess it's not anything. And by it, all I'm trying to do is whip the wall to see if there's a breakable block somewhere. I've been able to do it all of one time, but I think I was too far away, so I missed. I can't even survive this tunnel without getting hit. This place enraged me so much I threw my controller against the wall. No! This was the only time so far a game did this to me. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. That's what the dance emotes are for, so I don't do that. <laughs> I can get- okay, so there wasn't anything in between the two bits of fire. 
That time I think I was close enough. Which makes sense because they say after the fire dies down, so I would think it would be after the last bit of fire. But that's the one I can, like, never survive. I always get hit by the last one. <sighs> I don't think there's a way... This is your favorite? Oh, Blobble Wobble? I love that emote. Um... I don't think there's a way to... Like, even if I survive this first jump based on timing... Oh, do we have a mod around? I can do it. Um... Like, if you jump on this screen, it controls this- the- the pattern of the fire here. But the second screen, I think every time that you fall, it like resets the room and so the fire is always gonna get you if I fall on that side of the wall. So maybe I'm supposed to stick to the right side. That's what it means, kick off the wall, stick to the wall. Like, the middle wall. We have a little bit of health left. Oops, I meant to jump there and then I didn't. Oh, boo. It's like a little bit different every time. But the fire doesn't hurt that much. I didn't read it. I wasn't paying attention to it. It didn't happen. Please be careful though. I know you meant to write it in the Discord. Um, just be careful. Hmm, that was when I was too late coming over. Let's go heal. Ah, warm puddle. Bren, hi, how are you? Look at this. We've got notes and color-coded maps. And lore. And I've got digital notes, too. Channeling Brenamania note-taking. <laughs> this game is perfect for notes. I saw another streamer have a bot they can they can purge themselves. Oh, interesting. We don't have that. I'm so proud. Oh my gosh. Bren, we were talking about maybe playing Obra Dinn next too. If I want to follow on with more note taking. Um Obra Dinn, I know. Eyes get big. We'll see. I don't have that one yet. I have a couple other puzzles that have been on like the backlog for longer. We're probably gonna play a puzzle game next. Vanish command isn't too uncommon. Th I've never seen that. Just like exclamation point vanish and it deletes your last message. That's smart. I'll have to look into it. Um, What do we do next? I'm tired of that hallway. It's terrible. Ah. <sighs> Ooh. 
let's go see if there is a fairy. Next to the giant. Which I can't fight the giant because I don't have it set to the right um, sky disc setting. Okay, this is terrible. I thought I knew how to get back that way, but I don't. It's just B when I've seen it. Interesting. Oberdin is legit. I will not say how much or what kind of notes I took, but for me it was a special undertaking. That's awesome. Yeah, I totally- like, I get what you're saying. Um, I get how it works. I don't have it set up. So. Not today. But, maybe in the future. Okay, we're looking for... Oh, I wanted to come back here anyways. Um, to look at the sky disc room. No fairy in sight! Never a sky disc. We've learned so many things about moonlight, but I don't know what to do with any of them. Put it back to moon. I don't know. And that one fairy is supposed to help me with that other puzzle that looks like this one. Oberdin was a first person action. It's a puzzle game. It is, it is like first person, kind of, sort of. But it's a lot of like looking through documents. Never figured out this room either. Star Palace. Let's go back in the labyrinth from the other direction. Let's map this better. And find a map, that would be great. This is where the shop is, and a broken tablet. And dolphin statue, but I can't, oops, I forgot. <laughs> I can't go through there. I don't know if I ever tried to break that before, but it cannot be broken. It just looks like you should be able to walk through it. Okay, and then... Wait, we didn't even go to the right. We went up. 
Weird. Denied. Yeah. This room has the fake jewel. It's not real. Pay no attention. Ooh, money. It's just bats. I don't know, let's try it again. <laughs> Maybe this time it'll be different. Try it every time. Tread a different path. My map is useless here. This area just goes on forever. Yeah, yeah, something something definition of insanity. It doesn't count in this case. Total this is totally different. Okay, this is the starting room. So you go down here. But once you exit, there's like two staircases in this room. I should probably pause before I redraw this. And it's got, it's like offset, like this. I already messed it up. Whatever, I'm just gonna draw it. There's the shop. And now we're here. I am probably gonna need to move all of this. Not enough room. Cause these like in this room the ladders are positioned this way but in the rooms above they're here and here and here and here and then you come up here and it's like this weird flip of two ladders again. I don't know. And it says here. I'm just connecting those because because why not? Now it's the reverse of that again. It's like this, and then up here. Just pay no attention to how messy and terrible this looks. We're experimenting. I wanna go up here. Okay, that's not anything. They all start to look like this? Yeah, they all start to look like two ladders on the bottom, one on the top. Is this the shop again? I'm not gonna check that every time I see it. And the one that has the ladder on the top on the right hand side is Maybe it always has a cross in that room. Starting to look very similar. Okay, let's go somewhere else. Let's go back to the puddle. <laughs> Comfort puddle.
Now what? It isn't a real La Milana playthrough of Twin Labyrinth doesn't drive you a little bit nuts. Yeah, it's too much. I can't handle it. Let's go to Spring in the Sky. After the playthrough, you're allergic against hot springs. No, I love the hot springs. I'll never be allergic. Okay, here's Spring in the Sky. Isn't this where we started today? I forget. Some pruny toes, yeah. Warm puddle is life. I guess I should save. Have a drink of water. Started an inferno cavern. Okay, I forgot. That makes more sense. Do I want to go up or down? Let's go visit the fairy again for fun. This game can be a bit of a blur with more and more areas. I think the streams just become a bit of a blur of like, what did I work on today again? What did I, where did I go? Fairy time! Heal me from all these enemies! Can you help me with this wall seal thing? Do you know what to do with this? No. Aw, I landed on it, but... The fish wanted nothing to do with it. Wish she hung out for longer. No. And this is the sanctuary? Do you know what to do in here? Oh, what? I can open that now? Okay. We got an email. The symbol of the key. Me. Hey. There are items that look like rocks within with La Milana script on them. They can be used like keys in these here ruins. If you touch a keyhole or a small s a round mural with the same symbol, it will break. Okay, so there's even more wall seals that I can open. with the one I already found. I only have one and I opened two things with it and I just haven't opened all the things with it yet. Open the floodgates. Open the floodgates. The gears are turning. Elaborate mechanisms. We love to see it. Let's see if that other seal is there now. Are we powering the tower? How many things did we turn on? Oh my god, bats everywhere. Oh, this isn't even where I wanted to jump to. Nope, there's nothing here. That's okay, there's other stuff going on. So much water! Maybe now we can get to the mirror zone. Oh, all we had to do... 
But I still... Can I get to it? Because the water level's higher. I thought this was some elaborate puzzle. A glove! Beef up your upper body strength. Block pushing speed increases. Okay. A single glove. Not even a pair of gloves. This ha has filled with water. A bunch of these little side rooms have filled with water. It's really hard to know. I, I will say this in La Mulana. It is really hard to know which things are super cryptic puzzles and which things are you can't do this until you fight a boss which is totally fair i don't mind it but you start getting in the mindset of like every single thing is a really cryptic puzzle and then it's a little overwhelming so there is the metroidvania aspect where it's like yeah i didn't get a new ability i mean i got the wall seal but i fought a boss so you kind of have to like walk back and check a bunch of areas. Almost like when I played Link to the Past for the first time, I had no idea what I was doing and spent ages and ages going over the overworld trying to find, I can't remember exactly which spot, but certain spots. And we finally found it after combing the overworld and getting a, a hint. There's the La Mulana effect, something has happened somewhere. Mm-hmm. Gotta, gotta love the glove. Glove the love. Hmm. Hint describes what you're standing on right now, but this hint describes a thing you can do in July 1983 on another continent. Exactly! Like, it just... There's no distinction between this is a hint for this room, this is a hint for the overall world, this is... Yeah. This is something that looks like a puzzle, but it's actually just something that will unlock someday. Something happened somewhere, but it's never the place you're checking every, sing every single time for the last three weeks. Yeah. And we've done enough to where I keep finding things, but I haven't done a whole lot of backtracking just for the sake of backtracking. Sometimes we do. The shell noise made the good noise. New puzzle. What did that do? Oh, it's so hard. I wonder if that was one of the boxes for Eden. It was locked before. And this spiral right here, I can get into that room, but I don't know if I want to, because I think it's just a dead end. Is it, though? Yeah. Okay, it doesn't really matter. Block speed. Block pushing speed. Hmm... Oh, thanks for the shuriken. Hint, this hint is just art. Yeah, this one's just a diagram. Replaying it has let me see connections and game logics I'd never accounted for. Take it for perpetual mysteries. I bet. Yep. Okay, um, let's take another quick stretch break because we're hitting the four hour mark and we just did a thing that hopefully I'll be able to go through this area, see some new stuff, and then hopefully we can go to the mirror zone. We'll see. All right, thanks everybody. Let's, uh, let's do the music thing. For break. All right, we've got lots of places to go. We have a common terminology. What do you mean? Oh, what do you mean when you say mirror zone? The room in... What do I mean? The altar of mirrors that has an entrance to another, two entrances to another area. And there's that one clue that says, like, fill this something with water and you can do something about... Actually, it doesn't say water. I am choosing to hedge all my bets on the fact that the missing letters spell out water. Isn't that the expression? Hedging your bets? Whatever. That's what I think it says. <laughs> I'm not actually betting. 
don't gamble. Or gamble responsibly. <laughs> Wishy-washy advice from Jen. Um, uh, where are we going? Let's try to see if that one staircase is back. Also, let's save. If it's if it's back, if it's in place, it's never been there. Oh, my game skipped a skipped a frame or two there. This room has the silent philosopher. We could talk to him again and see if he's got anything to say. Are there stairs here yet? No, but there is a wall seal with a symbol that I haven't found yet. Are you still silent? I talked to Mulbrook. Stoic. Conveniently knocked down to the grail tablet. That worked in my favor this time. And we're getting kind of close to a refill. Oh, a Caltrops. Nice. Let's go down here. We haven't been down here in a while. He's heard what you said to Mulbrook and he does not approve. <laughs> he does not want to hang out with me. Still don't know what this does. Still an unopened chest. I'm gonna go in here and get bullied. And then, have I tried? Yeah. Have I tried attacking the ceiling? Yes. So strange. Okay, let's go down here. That is unlocked. That's new. Eden. I'm guessing that the locked pedestals and the locked chests are the Eden ones. Why? I don't know. Proximity of the tablets where I read that clue. Hoping that the game is helping me out by giving indicators for that clue. I'm expecting just to hear a shell horn and not see anything. Okay, cool. Let's go down here. This looks the same. Eden, there, yeah, proximity to where I read it. There we go. People say La Mulana doesn't deliver what people want. <laughs> we just want the shell horn. Nothing else matters. Anunnaki, do you know where Pazuzu is? I think I'm gonna get stuck in here. Um, I went all the way down here. 
Oh, it's also called the Mirror Waterfall. Mirror Zone, Mirror Waterfall. Interesting. Let's go here. <laughs> doesn't really help me. I don't really want to go back to the Room of Origin. So I think I've seen everything I want to see for now. I still don't know what's up with that fish with the red light, the angler fish. I should go visit the angler fish again. I know the fish is going to get me. Um At least it's kind of close by. Ish. Fish. I swear, every time I hit you, it takes so many tries. Look at this water. I feel like this waterfall is moving so much faster than it was before. I guess that would make sense. While the scale sphere has damage negation with and the ice cape damage reduction, apparently it was the other way around in the original. Really? Interesting. any clues about this fish it's a fish the water moves the tower transformed power it flows from here I don't know if I'm I can I don't know if anything happened in Sun Temple yet because I feel like I have to pull the plug in Anunnaki's room for that to fully take effect. But I can go look just to see. This room. What is this room? You are the... fourth child. With the body of a fish. Both have damage negation unless I've been paying zero attention in the original. My whip doesn't even hurt you. But I get hurt by you. Can I go under you when you're up high like that? This is where I live now. What if I bring a fairy to see you? Would that be fun? Would you like to meet a fairy? I don't know if we can make it back down there in time. Can you warp with a fairy? I haven't tried that yet. Oh, you have to wait until it appears? Oh, good. It came right back. I've never seen the fish that high up. It was glitched. Hacks. I'm speedrunning. Splat. Ow.
I don't know what the quickest way down there is. Yay! First try. Okay, what do you think? Fly on over there. You don't have to wait for me. Oh, come on. Cast a magic spell on this fish and turn it back into a human. Turn it into a key. Just gonna keep beating it up. It makes a noise like it's taking damage, but... I feel really bad just slapping the fish over and over again. Oh, I guess I shouldn't have. <laughs> Look, this took me so long because... Animal cruelty, okay? <laughs> I didn't think it was gonna be an Ankh jewel. <laughs> it's fine, we were busy doing other stuff. I wish I didn't glitch that fish. I served, solved the murder the fish puzzle. That's not a puzzle. That's a- this doesn't seem like it's doing anything even though I've hit the fish like 10 times in a row. I should probably move on because I look silly. This game is a forever battle of like, is this an, embar an embarrassing attempt or is this actually what the game wants you to do? <laughs> Thanks for the hype. Okay, um, do I have any clues about where the spring in the sky onk is? If all else fails, whip random things until something happens. Apparently, that's like the, um, oh, what was it? The tooth in the dig. You use the tooth on everything, and there was something in Monkey and Curse of Monkey Island too that I just kept using on everything, and it worked for everything. I don't have tons of Spring in the Sky notes. Sail away. Fishmaster holds the red light. Okay, all right, that was the Fishmaster. I have another note of that that doesn't take out so many words, though, because I paraphrased that one a lot. Sail away, there thou will find where Bahamut slumbers, the fishmaster holds the red light. Okay. I wonder if the f that was Bahamut. I don't love the whole fishmaster thing. It's fine. <laughs> um, now I'm looking for the, the onk. Read the hint again. Sail away. There thou will find where Bahamut slumbers. The fishmaster holds the red light. There's a boat that I've seen. So we can go back and look at that maybe. But, um, otherwise, I don't know. It doesn't really explicitly say that Bahamut is the Fishmaster. And don't answer that. <laughs> um. Spring in the sky. When the waters of the ocean calmed, a new child was born. In pursuit of the sun and moon, man and woman, life and death, a small wingless gillless child was born. That was from notes I took here with the origin seal. Mulbrook. Eden. Find the source of a phenomenal trap in a, in a place bathed in moonlight. Sorry, just rereading. I just wanted to hear it again. Yeah, of course. Happy to read it again. Then, these are mostly my Inferno notes. 
and the Mulbrook notes from when we went back and saw her again. And that's it. I'm trying to find... Spring in the Sky. Notes. About the Ankh. Those who plunder the red light shall never escape. That was a sun temple note, I think. Inferno. It's a little bit all over the place in the written form. I just really don't- I feel like Spring in the Sky I have the least amount of notes on, for whatever reason. Maybe we could- maybe we go talk to the Philosopher again. I feel like it, we just t checked the boat room, the sanctuary, and we just checked the Philosopher, and we just checked the staircases, but, like, let's check them all again. Open the floodgate of O.N. The water will flow. Hmm. What does spring in the sky say when you go look at the save tablet again? A place built by the giants. Okay. People under the sea. Mother's wrath. Sank earth under the sea. Until a child with strength to rise was born. The priest Owens is a fish. Only he may close the floodgate. Get a helmet for waterfall two, waterfalls. Two brave souls. Quiet solitude. Rock reaches a high place. I wonder if the two brave souls is the two giants in that one room with the chest that I haven't been able to open. Maybe. But that's in the mausoleum. Let's go back up to... Let's go back up to the top again really quick. Hopefully quick. Sacred Lake. Oh, I didn't check off a bunch of boxes too. This was the sacred lake. Yeah, is that what you're saying, Jim? I didn't do it. Now I could do it. This was the... Is this an Eden pedestal? But I pushed it. Philosopher. Wall seal. This was a wall seal. Actually, I should have marked it too. And I never did, because I thought there was only one wall seal per area. And that was wrong. I could go back in this room, too, if I wanted. Which is kind of a pain to get to. Wait, you're here now? Because I opened that other one? <laughs> I always forget the fish at the bottom. And then I have to wait for the elevator again. nuisance. La Mulana players want one thing, and it's woolololo. <laughs> Coda, welcome in. How's it going? Hey, we found- <gasps> I can buy Caltrops! They're expensive compared to all of our other replenishable with 10 gold. Also, it's the fish! We have an emote for that. Oh, I don't have a hot button for it anymore, for a stream deck. We know why the seal only now appeared, exactly. 
thank you, Coda. I appreciate it. What are you buying, stranger? Well, we've got a lot of money now. Should probably spend it. <laughs> spend it all. Okay, that's good. 14 caltrops, 14 shuriken, and 12 weights. I believe the fish so hard. I bullied the fish so hard that it decided to do capitalism, apparently. <laughs> All right. Um I would like to continue my climb. If possible, if I don't get bullied by these other creatures. I wonder what that other platform is for. I wonder if it just breaks when we jump on it. Some of the platforms are like that. Let's go all the way up here, because I haven't been up here in a minute. Waterfall approach, which is this whole region. Fish was on a break for too long and needed to get back to his job. It did say if it is... Hmm. If it is Bahamut... Where, I keep not being able to find where I wrote this down. If it is Bahamut... They were slumbering, and I woke them up so they could get back to work. But, I don't know about that. Oops. I feel like the boat looks slightly different. I could be imagining it. I'm not. It does look different. Look at my cool red light. Can I push the boat? Does this area- wait, there was water coming from here and it's gone now. Wasn't there water flowing through the wall? Maybe not. Maybe I imagined that. Bully or be bullied, yeah. Thanks for the love. I appreciate it. This is very strange. Clearly I need the buckler. Okay, well, not a lot going on. Uh, let's try our hardest to go to the room of origin without getting bullied by fish or bats. No, oh, I'm gonna get bullied. At least bully me in a, in a way that doesn't knock me back away from where I'm trying to go. No. I'm just gonna jump up and over like this and hope for the best. Okay. This room looks exactly the same as I remember. With exploding pigs. talks about the wingless, gillless child. And this was the mini boss room down here. Now it's just a normal room. And this is where I first read the sigil thing. They're definitely 
It's, it's the seals. It's the wall seals. I don't know, whatever. I have this drawn already. I'm gonna draw it again. If this is just in case. One, two, three, four. Like if this is the counting system. This last one is really hard to see. I don't know exactly what shape it's making. With a big question mark. Daxon, have a good one. Take care. Thank you. We'll see you soon. I need some uh, chapstick real quick as well. Oh, is this already running out? These tubes are really good, but they run out too quickly. The text mentions four, but five. I think the four on top are the things that you get out of the chest. But I think the one on the bottom is showing you what the wall seals look like. That are more circular. I don't, like, I don't know if that's correct or not, but... That's my guess. Because I think it's so hard. It's like very pixely and fuzzy and whatever. But I think the one on the bottom is the same as the one in the upper left. But the one in the upper left is the one in our inventory. It's like a gravestone shape. And the one on the bottom is a circle with like the outline that the wall seals have. What else was I going to go look at? Um, I'm going to get rid of this circle because I drew that when I first saw those like they're not spinning gears. They're little they're little shapes with red lights in the center. There's two of them in this room. I don't know what they are, if they're anything. I'm gonna draw one next to it and write red light, but I'm not sure. Just so I don't get confused and think that circle is a wall seal, because that's also the, it's the same symbol I've been using. And the fairy's back. Can you help me? Oh, it's a new fairy. <gasps> you have a key! Wait, pause. You didn't have a key before. Just sometimes you show up and you happen to have this important key? But we're nowhere close to the puzzle I failed to solve. I need to pause because I feel like you're on a timer. Ugh. Rude. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna go about my business. My hunch is that... I'm supposed to... I don't know if it's like RNG. And you get the key fairy... in the labyrinth eventually. 
is the dream, is the hope. I want her to go this way instead. I'm gonna run out of time. Well, this was fun. Whee! Hey, come with me and talk to this guy. <laughs> do you want to hang out with a fairy? Silence. Oh, let's do science. Um, silence and science. Let's see if she comes with us when we warp. She does! That's very good to know. I don't have a, a warp tablet in the labyrinth, though. But I have one... in the mausoleum for the other entrance. Otherwise, I'd have to take her through the sun temple entrance into the inferno, into the labyrinth, up all the way around to the puzzle. Ugh, what a pain. There's already a fairy in the labyrinth. It's fine. There was something else I wanted to do. Check the mirror zone. I need some good old mausoleum music. Where's my mausoleum map? Right here. Wait, no. This isn't where it is. <laughs> I'm confused! Well, at least we got to listen to the music for a second. What's this one? <laughs> There's so many different zones. And this one is probably my least favorite. You're still following me this whole time? Maybe you stay with me until I find the thing. Does Mulbrook confirm that it's you? Meh. Meh. I think it's okay if I fall here, so I'm just gonna fall here. Whee! <sighs> oh, she's gone. No, it wasn't okay that I fell there. Gosh darn it. Okay, maybe we try it again. Oh, I got the refill. The one highlight of my life. When we get a refill. But I don't think... Oops. Okay, try again. Did anybody else get the most lost in here? I feel like I'm way more able to navigate in the other areas, but Sun Temple is just nonsense in my brain. Oh, 
other than the labyrinth. But that's kind of the point of the labyrinth, I think. I don't even need to jump up this way. What's this room again? Uh, yeah, I found you. It's less straightforward than others. I still don't love trying to decide which path and gate of guidance I was really after. Gate of guidance is tricky. Gate of guidance feels like it's a bunch of different areas all crammed together into one. This one, this pyramid just gets, every time I get stuck in it, I can't figure out what to do. Okay, so this is all the same. Nothing changed here. But I think sometime the water, after we pull the plug, the water will fill up somehow and it'll rise enough to where I can jump up and reach that seal. And that'll open one of these doors. That's the hope. Um... So now I've got, in Spring in the Sky, there's like a weird boat situation. I need to pull the plug on the water. And what else is left to do in there? I, and I lost track of the Eden stuff. I don't know how many pedestals I've stood on and how many chests I've opened. And I certainly haven't stood before one of the highest rank, highest rank in a place bathed in moonlight. I know I haven't done that yet, because I don't even know what that means yet. Let's check this room one more time. The room where we have to pull the plug. And then we'll go check the room of Eden in the Gate of Guidance. I actually think when I left the Nebra Sky Disc the last time, I did set it to Moonlight. So... Hopefully that's still where it is. I don't think there's like a way to tell. And there's still this thing. Do you think the Ankh is in here? My favorite item. The Ankh jewel. Look at this! Look at this! I just love how we hold it up over our head so excitedly. Face of the highest rank. Let's go to Gator Guidance then. and find the Eden room. It's... in here. Door to Eden. So we just need to drop down one and go left a bunch. It hits with one damage. Gotcha. I'm guessing most people don't use it that way, <laughs> but it's something. I was wondering why it makes that little clink noise when you uh, hit it against stuff sometimes. Ooh -la -la -la. 
Okay, still nothing here. Zara, how's it going? There's a mod or something gives you the jewel as the only weapon. Oh no. We do have map cam. Yeah. That's that would be I wouldn't want to play in that mode. I forget there's like a really quick way to oops. Oh, to get punched by a giant fist. I still never figured this room out either. What the heck? <sighs> Sleep's a little weird, but I'm good. I'm sorry Sleep's being weird. I hate that. Oh, getting bullied by a worm. Oh, we should go buy that other- do we really want to spend 150 coins on that other software, or should I save up for the bullets? I don't have to decide right now. Weeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
Everyone, not swell. Everybody's been really respectful about it, and I appreciate it. Okay, nothing's happening. <laughs> Knowing that Onkjul is categorized as a sub-weapon means there's much less you can guess about inventory. I don't know, I hadn't put much thought to it. Like, we have what we have. Usable items. Sub weapons, main weapons, items, seals. Like, I guess I hadn't put a lot of thought into the layout of the menu and how many slots there are. Um, but that's like part of the playthrough, too, you know? Like, I don't want direction to examine those categories. I don't want direction at all. I guess... And we still don't know who Azuzu is. Oh, come on. I pressed the button. Or Pazuzu. Azuzu? Zuzu. Okay, good. This is good. We have, like, no health for this part. Oops, that's not what I meant to do. I hate that you have to spend a wait to get this fairy, but it'll be worth it. There's so many of you! Is it the special one? Oh, is it the special one every time now? I don't know. Key Fairy! Oh, there's a way up that way. Have I ever gone up that way? Wait a minute. All the fairies are special. You're right, you're right, you're right. I don't think I've ever taken that ladder up. Why not? Why didn't even, why, I didn't, why didn't I mark it? Oh well. We're getting bullied again. Let's see if she helps us in here. Oh, well. Not with get without getting beat up first! Wait, I've never fallen down here before. Oh, I have been in this room before, though. There's, like, cool murals on the wall that are really colorful. Oh. We're gonna die. That was an utter failure, but... Um, we saw the room with the cool colors on the wall. Aren't you supposed to be healing me? Or do you not heal? You only give key. We can go to the labyrinth. Perhaps, but one more time. Nope, rock, 
knock back the wrong way. That thing drops flares a lot. I wonder if I'm supposed to be using the flares on the birds more often. I don't know. Oh, she's gone. that worked out. Oh, but she's not here! They have to, like, regenerate. Okay, let's go through that other staircase that I found, then. Oh, I think I went- I went the complete wrong way anyway. I was thinking- No, I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking. I'm turned around. In the labyrinth, of course. Is that one stuck at the bottom? This ladder. My hunch is that I was probably panicking about surviving, so I didn't climb it. Just a couple of dolphins in here. Is this the mini boss room? We'll see. <laughs> Are you Pazuzu? You look like the Futurama thing. Is not going well. Did that hit you? I don't think so. That one did. You stopped time. Okay. Pazuzu? Question mark? Mini boss. Screen breaks. That's enough for one day. I have so much to write down into my digital notes and transfer over and ponder. We did a lot today. I'll just do a quick double save here, and <laughs> thanks, Invader Jim. <laughs> Without a nudge, I know no nudges today. Almost needed one, but we've got plenty to do. 